if you would work really hard, yeah. make sure that you're all working that night, bring as many people as you can to vote and uh, do the caucus like nobody's ever done the caucus before. And we're going to win that, but we have to we have to win the other. And I think that sends a really good set. The more we win, they're going to see that signal for the November election. And we have to win. You know, the one way you do win is you swamp them. Uh, if you swamp them, there's a point at which they can only they can only cheat so much. They will cheat. They're going to try and cheat like hell. Uh, it's uh, so sad to see. It's so sad to have to report. But if we swamp them, and part of swamping them is winning the primaries in record numbers, that I think we're going to do that. So I think we're going to do a lot better in places that normally wouldn't be considered Republican territory. But let's not assume that. And you look at your five or six swing states. I think that um, that's the only thing I ask, is that I ask those states in particular, less so you, but those states in particular, to guard the vote. I use the term guard the vote. We want to show how we won the election, not for purposes of what we want to do is we want to win this one that's coming up, because it's a lot simpler. Think to the future. But you have to learn from history. If you don't learn from history, you're a fool. And we have to learn from history. So I hope that that's going to happen, because we have so much evidence. We have so, And everybody knows it, and they know.